Two and a half years ago, Roadrunners Captain Craig Cunningham nearly died and then eventually lost part of a leg. Now, thanks to a Tucson native working in San Diego, Cunningham is back on the ice. It's a moment hockey fans and the city of Tucson will not soon forget. The moment Craig Cunningham nearly died on the ice just before a Roadrunners game. A sudden and severe heart attack nearly took his life. And because of complications, it later did take the lower half of his left leg. He has uh, not the easiest uh, below the knee amputation to fit. Um, and so he was running into a lot of prosthetic problems. The man who made Cunningham's prosthetic? Peter Harsh says it was a challenge to find the balance of function and comfort for Cunningham's leg. He's had a lot of atrophying of the muscle, the soft tissue, and the bone has become um, very sharp. It's kind of like having razor blades inside your soft tissue. Oh, wow. He started with a comfortable prosthetic for walking, then running. Then he tried something he and his team had never done before, build a prosthetic for skating. Yeah, it's kind of our first shot at it, actually. Myself and uh, another prosthetist, Randall, uh, we took one of those uh, tucks, I guess they're called, the blades, and took a bower skate, and we did some customization. This video from Cunningham's Instagram shows the former NHL and AHL player skating like a pro. I guess some of his NHL hockey player buddies said, ah, you could never skate backwards, so when he caught the edge, I guess, going backwards, they kind of made a laugh a joke at him that, he was never good at it anyway. Peter Harsh thinks he'll keep working with Cunningham for years to come. Cunningham posted on Instagram what all Roadrunner fans are thinking only 365 days until next season. And Cunningham will likely be a coach someday and will need to skate during practice, and he's well on his way to doing that. All right, we'll be right back. You're watching KGUN 9 on your side.